Oh, you rolling raptors. It doesn't look like it, but I'm on my way to a nice set of stairs. And I'm planning on riding it backwards. But first, something about my setup. These are the power sliders zoom red, but I've changed the stock liner with an FR liner. That liner is more comfortable than the original one, and I can lace it all the way to the top, which gives me much more control. The frame's the 4x90 Kaiser Flux. It's a big wheel frame with small sole plates for grinding. The 4x90 is also my favorite setup for this kind of obstacle. At this skate park, practically no one rolls downstairs, so let me show all the kids how you ride that thing. Riding stairs really isn't that difficult, but you've got to master the basic posture for doing it safely. And you've got to practice, practice, practice on smaller sets of stairs to build up the confidence to tackle a big one without any hesitation. Speed's your friend, but it's scary to approach those stairs at some speed. That seemed to be an attack on my camera. Slow-mo footage always freaks me out. It never looks as smooth as stair riding feels in real time. I've collected the best tutorials for stair riding in a playlist. And yet another skateboard throws itself at my camera. Pathetic. What you don't really see is that most of my weight is on my front leg, not on the back leg that is leading. I really push my shins into the tongues of my liners. Your weight has got to be on your toes, otherwise you'd fall backwards and break your neck. Let's try not to die, shall we? Thanks for watching. If this video brought some light into your dark depressing day, then honor it with a like. Gratitude. Take care, watch your back and keep rolling. See you next ride.